Hello everybody, thank you so much for watching. My name is Alexander, I'm a Porsche certified sales professional at Porsche West Palm Beach and thank you so much for watching my YouTube videos. In today's YouTube background video, we're gonna take a look at this stunning 2021 Porsche 911 Turbo S Coupe. This vehicle just arrived in our pre-owned inventory. Please contact me directly via cell phone or email with my contact information being in the video description if you're interested in this specific Porsche 911 Turbo S. So in today's walk around video, we're gonna take a look at the details, both on the outside as the inside. And again, if any questions, feel free to reach out to me. This one is a very special one, although every 911 Turbo S, of course, is a special Porsche. Now, the reason it's extra special is this one is paint to sample. The paint to sample color is called Lichtgrün, which from German to English translates to light green. A color uh, dates back to the, within the Porsche brand to the 1970s, I believe 1974, based on my basic research. What a beautiful, stunning color it is especially on a 911 Turbo S. Looking at the front fascia, we can see the original front fascia design of the latest generation 911 Turbo S. The 992 is now the eighth generation of the iconic Porsche 911 sports car. Such a wide front fascia with this aggressive styling. You can see the Porsche Active Aerodynamics front splitter currently in the down position as I wanted to show you guys this aerodynamic element. The beautiful 911 Turbo S model designation imprinted in that uh, front splitter there. This one also equipped with the optional adaptive cruise control and optional surround view camera system. Now the 992 Turbo S even wider as the previous generation 911 Turbo Turbo S, which was the 991. Look at the shape of these front fenders, the width of the body, fantastic. You can also see the LED matrix headlights, which are standard for the 992 Turbo S. Mentioned many times before, love the way that Porsche positioned the new headlights. Also the inside housing is truly a work of art. This one also optionally equipped with the exclusive design wheels. Now we saw this specific wheel design introduced a couple of years back on the 911 Turbo S exclusive series, which they made 500 coupes for the world and 200 cabriolets. It was an optional extra on those cars, but what a beautiful design. I'm so happy that Porsche brought it over also as an optional extra on the 992 Turbo and Turbo S model. Still center locking, as you can see, in this case finished in optional high gloss black by Porsche exclusive Manufacture. And it's the same also for the brake calipers, normally finished in yellow for the PCCB, the Porsche Carbon Composite Brake System, which is standard for the Turbo S. But in this case, the original owner changed the yellow calipers to high gloss black. Some other cool elements here on the outside, as you can see the mirror caps have been finished in carbon fiber, which their Porsche will paint the lower section of the mirror cap, uh, sorry, of the mirror housing in high gloss black. And more carbon fibers, even the roof in this case, has also been finished in carbon fiber. Continuing here to the side, you can see also the side air intakes finished in high gloss black. Makes sense against the other black elements on the outside, looking stunning. And again, that's another Porsche exclusive manufacture option. And the bottom, of course, the standard side skirts for the Turbo and the Turbo S. In the back, we're running now a 21 inch rear wheel instead of 20 inches on the 991 generation. Rear axle steering system still standard. We're also running a wider rear tire now with 315 rear section tire, while the 991, the previous generation, still was running a 305. With the Porsche Active Aerodynamics front splitter being in the down position, this means the rear wing is in the up position as they, that is one system. Of course, to create extra downforce at high speed driving or can be activated with a press in the PCM, a button in the PCM system. Looking fantastic, love the engineering part, the visual aspect of these struts here of the rear wing, looking fantastic. Active all-wheel drive has now been standard now for many years for the Turbo Turbo S models. 640 horsepower, twin turbo, 3.8 liter flat six, connected to the all-wheel drive through an eight-speed PDK dual clutch transmission. Top track speed well over 200 miles an hour, and we've all seen the zero to 60 measurements. Uh, some have been measured at about two and a half seconds from zero to 60, just an incredible performance level. This one also equipped with the optional Porsche Sport Exhaust System, with the tailpipes being finished in high gloss black, which is a 992 Turbo Turbo S first, as it wasn't available as a factory option on the 991 generation. We can also see the optional clear tail lights, the Porsche letters finished in high gloss black, and the model designation once again in high gloss black, all as factory options. So we covered most of the details here on the outside. Let's have a look on the inside. Comfort access is now standard on the 2021 992 models. We can see a lot of beautiful features, the carbon fiber side sills, LED illuminated, uh, the full leather package here on the door, the 930 interior package, which is standard on the Turbo S, dating back to the classic 930 Turbo from back in the day, this pattern here on the door panels and also here in the center part of the seats. These are the 18-way adjustable sports seats plus the Porsche Crest has been, sorry, the Turbo S model designation has been embossed in the headrest and also here in this center armrest as beautiful design details. 
Carbon fiber can also be found on the inside with the matte carbon fiber going all the way across on the dashboard. Additional, so the GT steering wheel finished again with matte carbon fiber. The car also has the optional Burmester 3D surround sound system. Even leather here on the side sill. So here we have the carbon sill itself, but even this area here covered in beautiful black leather. The stitching itself is finished in chalk. This is a full deviated stitching package. Also the seat belts, as you can see, finished in chalk. An incredible, incredible package.